Welcome to Animal A Day! 10 Giant African Land Snail Facts The Alien That Invaded Florida 1. The Giant African Land Snail is a big shelled gastropod in the Achatinidae family. The Giant African Snail moniker is used for several other species as well. 2. They were originally found in East Africa, possibly in Tanzania or Kenya, but were introduced unintentionally or otherwise in many parts of the world. They can now be found in the US, China, and on some islands in just about every ocean. 3. They are the biggest type of land-dwelling snail on the planet, as far as we know. They can grow up to 8 inches or 20 centimeters in length. Their shells are of a similar size to an average person's clenched fist. 4. Giant African land snails are one of the worst and most prolific invasive species of all time. They eat over 500 different plants and crops, adapt well to many environments, and spread human disease. They are very hardy, as about 9 out of every 10 snail eggs will make it to adulthood. 5. These snails are even destructive towards buildings. They supplement their mostly vegetarian diet by eating concrete, stucco, and paint to gain much needed calcium. They also consume paper products like cardboard sometimes. 6. African giant land snails are carriers of rat lungworm, a nasty parasitic nematode they gain by eating rat feces. A human can become infected if they eat an undercooked snail, or even just by handling one. The nematode can cause severe meningitis, which can lead to death. 7. They're hermaphrodites, meaning they have both sets of reproductive organs. Just because they have the cells of both genders doesn't mean they can impregnate themselves. They normally cannot, but it has happened in a few recorded cases. 8. They have four antennae, with the two longer ones used for sight, and the two shorter ones used for smell. 9. The mucus produced by these snails serve multiple purposes. It helps them move more smoothly on surfaces, aids in retaining moisture, and provides a defense mechanism against predators. And 10. They've been a problem in Florida for a long time. After being introduced there in 1966, it took almost 10 years for them to be wiped out. Then again in 2011, more were found, so the state spent $24 million in the next 10 years getting rid of them. They even had dogs trained to sniff them out. They declared them eradicated in 2021, but the snails are very persistent, and once more they were found in June 2022. Thanks for watching. Now take that subscribe button to the zoo.